Hi everybody, Malik the Magic Guy for ExpertVillage.com. One of the more important principles in card magic is something called the key card principle, and that's what I'm going to teach you about now. We're going to uh, combine that with a principle called glimpsing in a little while. But basically what the key card principle is, is when you take a card that you know of, let's say the bottom card of the deck, and you use that to mark the position of another card. So let's say they had selected a card like the Three of Clubs. We would have ways of putting this card on top of or underneath the Three of Clubs, and we could go through the deck, and by looking for our key card, we could tell what card was next to it. That's a basic use of the key card, but you can use it for other things as well. For instance, if I had had a setup of cards on the bottom of the deck, so let's say I had uh, the four aces on the bottom of the deck, or, or near the bottom of the deck. Let's say I had them behind the king. And I had some other cards here. What I could do is if I wanted to spread through the cards and not let people see that I had the aces, but I knew they were behind the king, I could stop when I got to the king. And then I would know that the next four cards behind it are the ace. So anytime you use a card or a group of cards to mark the positions of other cards in the deck, that's the key card principle. In a, in a minute, I'm going to teach you some other ways to use it, some tricks you can do with it, and some fun ways to uh, utilize the key card principle.